Hey everybody, this is Dutch at the Mystic Mountain Homestead, and today we're going to talk about pass-through charging with the Blue Eddy. Alright, let's get into it everyone. Yeah, I'm filthy. I've been out there cutting trees today. I sure have. <laughs> Alright. Alright, we got the AC unit running and a fan going as well and a couple other devices and it's pulling out as you can see about 1060 watts and I'm pulling in 800 on this side and 400 on this side that's 1300 total so as you can see the, the main unit is charged fully now so it's in standby mode the other two units, the B300s that I have hooked up, are each still charging, and they're charging at 300 watts that are passing through. So that's basically what pass-through charging is. It allows you to run your devices at whatever wattage it is, as long as you have more watts coming in than you're using, it will do the pass-through charging. If I am wrong on this, someone please correct me, but I'm pretty sure that is the understanding that I, from what I've been reading about. Please comment down below. Let's get a little discussion going on in, on pass-through charging, because I've seen several other comments about what is pass-through charging, how does pass-through charging work. I've heard also that the um, the, this unit will throttle down after it's at like I think 90% but I have not seen that as you see it's still at 96% here and it's still pass through charging and it's not throttled down it's 800 still coming in 402 coming in on that size so I don't know what they're talking about when they say it throttles down to 250 and it wasn't Blue Eddy people that said it it was some of the, you all in the comments down in there down below so if you can explain that to me a little bit more that'd be greatly appreciated I got the AC running I'm 24 7 now with the, I have obviously enough power coming in that will charge through the day and run I uh, have updated my panels I have now 600 watts of panels on this side and then I switched one of the B 300s to a 450 watt solar panel that I have. That's a, a thing. Yeah, that's right. 450 watt solar panel. And this side just has 1300 hooked up to it. And so over, well, I'll talk a little bit about over paneling. Like I said, this side has 1300 hooked up to it. And why reason I over panel and reason I believe people over panel is so that way when the sun comes up, you can get the maximum in power. Like it says that you can do 900 watts on this side. I've seen it do 917 before, 920, 925. But um, that way you get that full 900 as soon as that sun comes to its, you know, highest point or not even its highest point, but as soon as it hits those panels, you'll start getting a large quantity of power and that's why I believe people do over paneling I've also been thinking about I'm um, setting up a uh, east to west solar panels instead of doing south facing only and then I would do a um, a parallel I believe it's called where I do where it's the same it would be a thousand on one side and a thousand on the other so that way when the sun is on the east side I'd still get a thousand and when the sun's on the west side I'd still get a thousand if that's wrong, someone please comment, because that's what I'm thinking about doing. I've been reading about the east to west facing, and they're saying that, that you get a higher power rating, and I have moved my panels around a little bit more, and as soon as that sun comes up and you got them facing east, you're getting max power out of those panels. As soon as it just starts to crack over that edge of this, you know, horizon. So, that's really it for the video today, y'all. Um, like I said, like, comment, subscribe. Um, yeah, most definitely comment. Let's get a thread going on down here below so we can get some answers and questions for everyone that's been commenting on the other videos about this topic. Alright, y'all. Until next time, stay tuned and there will be more updates on the Blue Eddy. I hope to get a 
a Blue Eddy AC 500, I believe, when they come out with that in September, is what my plan is, is to upgrade my unit to one of those. Until next time.